Hello YouTube, this is Easy Tech Help here, and today I'm going to show you how to do this pretty awesome text effect in Adobe, in Adobe Photoshop CS4. It's really easy to do, it looks difficult, but it's really easy. A lot of people have been sending me requests um, how to make them, because they see seen my work on Twitter. So, first you want to go to Edit, Fill, and black will be the pretty good background for this so we'll just set it as black okay when you do black you want to go over here your test effect your text effect and it's just still in the type tool because my computer been running a little slow lately so just wait for this to progress okay and now you want to make your text Make sure the font, I mean the color of your text, is white. Okay? This only works when it's white. Okay, I'm going to put easy tech help. Put this directly in the middle. Okay? So, now that that's directly in the middle, this is kind of the difficult part. Not really. Go to up here to filter, stylize. Um, stylize and go down here all the way down to wind it's gonna ask you the type of layer and whatever go to okay okay first before I do the wind I want to right click on easy tech help oh and I guess I can't do that okay I'm gonna right click on easy tech help and I want to duplicate my layer it's really important that you duplicate your layer and go to your original. It's really important that you duplicate your layer because it's not going to work unless you do it. Because you need something to fall back on if you mess up on the first one. So, let's get started again. Filter, stylize, wind. Okay, because we already did that step. And from the right, okay, and go ahead and press Control F. A lot of people get control F mixed up with F control. Press control first, then F. Because you press F, then it'll just do some crazy stuff to your um, Photoshop. So go back up here to filter, stylize, wind. And this time, make sure the method is wind. And this time, you're going to go to from the left. Okay? Control F. Okay, I guess that worked. And now. You want to go to okay this is the part where you're gonna be like what what is she doing it's kind of weird but just hang in with me image rotate image image rotation 90 clockwise it's gonna turn so you're gonna think I'm doing something wrong but I'm not is this is how it's supposed to be okay you go to stylize wind from the right okay Control F. Control F. You want to go back up here to filter, stylize, wind from the left. Okay. And now go to Control F. Okay, that's what you're going to do. And now you want to right click on your Easy Tech Help and go to your blending options. Oh, I'm sorry. I just got mixed up here. After you finish doing um, your thing, you want to go to image, image rotation, 90 counterclockwise. So I get right back to the direction. Okay, now let's go back. Right click, blending options. And now I'm going to make this a surprise. So I'm going to cover that up. So you want to go to your color overlay red okay you see what it does to your text it makes the whole thing red it doesn't you don't have to have it red um another good thing you can do is you can go to neon green neon green looks good with it so i'm going to go over here to overlay right here i mean you can change your color whatever you want I'm going to show you what neon green looks like. It's pretty cool. They're all pretty cool. So That's what it would look like. So if you like this video, please write, subscribe, and comment. And please follow me on Twitter. 
Um, yeah, follow me on Twitter. Because I like, I have, it's funny how I have 47 subscribers, but no one's following me on Twitter. And so follow me on Twitter. My link will be in the description. So please rate, subscribe, and comment. Bye.